Hi friends! So today I want to talk about a concept that at least I think I've come up with called unearned guilt. This came to me in the morning because I was considering the impending time change coming up and was thinking about how my morning ritual used to be before I had a kid and that it looked like uh, me putting together a lunch for my husband, um, sometimes a breakfast. And I thought to myself, I really haven't done that in, at least since my daughter was born. So that's about two and a half years ago now. And I felt really guilty. All of a sudden, just really guilty that I hadn't done that, that I hadn't been a better wife. And, you know, I even used to have to wake up my husband every single morning to get him to work on time. And he's much better now. Since we had a kid, things have changed. But I would have to put forth an exponentially larger effort than just myself to get him out the door and get him going. And so I took a step back and really thought to myself, why? Why am I feeling guilty about this? Because do you think that he ever put a lunch together for me? No. <laughs> no, he didn't. And we both work full time. But I can't recall that he had ever done that for me. Um, and I didn't hold, I don't hold that against him and I didn't. Um, and I'm sure that he doesn't feel guilty for not making me breakfast or not making me lunch. And yet I had that. So that's when that idea came to me of unearned guilt. And I know that might be a confusing thing to say, but to me, Unearned guilt means guilt that you don't deserve. <laughs> you don't need it. You should just let it go. And that could be anything from something that you're imagining, you're making up in your head. Um, for me, it, this food thing, it would be that, oh, my, my husband thinks less of me because I make, didn't make him breakfast. He probably doesn't even care. Um, or it could even be something that isn't imagined. Maybe there is guilt put on you by somebody else that you don't deserve though. So again, just thinking more and digging more into why I was having these feelings, it really came to me that somewhere along the line, whether it was something, a comment he made or something I believed about myself, I came up with this idea that my time is less valuable than his time. That sounds especially ridiculous when I know that I work full time the same hours that he works and I put forth at least, if not more, effort than he does in keeping our house together and helping our family as a whole. And yet for some reason, because I make less, I made that into I am less valuable. And I realized that this became an infestation in my mind and created all of these feelings of inadequacy. And I cannot tell you how long it's been that I have thought about this stuff and let it hurt, hurt my, hurt myself, I guess is what I'm trying to say. Um, it really hurt me and took root into my mind. And just that these, those feelings have been out. And I'm not saying this is the only time. I've definitely struggled with feelings of not being enough in the past. This is something that was specific. Um, feeling, I guess, inadequate as a mother, as a wife, um, in a family setting. And I just... It just, it needs to stop. It needs to stop because I wouldn't put that same stuff on him. So why would I put it on myself? I guess this is the thing that I would like to get at today is 
what unearned guilt are you carrying with you? What are those feelings of inadequacy that you need to just get rid of? So one thing that you need to know, and I need to know too, is that um, you're deserving. <laughs> I'm deserving. Um, you deserve a good life. You deserve to feel valued and feel like your time is just as precious as a spouse or someone else who's making more money than you are. And just because, um, just because my husband makes more money than me doesn't mean that I'm a less valuable person or that my time is less valuable. So I know that this is just one example, but I hope that it opens up something for you. And if you have some examples of your unearned guilt, I would love to hear it. Um, and especially if you have a way of overcoming it. For me, it was just this realization and recognition that I had this inside of myself. So hopefully that helps you. And I would love to hear more from you if, if that's something that speaks to you in your life. So again, what unearned guilt are you carrying? What can you let go? What can you remove from your back and chuck into the river, never look at it again? That's all for today. Lots of love and have a great day.